Rose was a woman with impeccable taste in shoes, but horrible judgment when it came to men. Once the girlfriend of Stillwater drug kingpin Angela Lopez, Luz found herself bouncing from one Colombian drug czar to the next. She knew what she was doing was wrong, but let's be honest, who can really afford red soul stilettos without a little drug money? But here in the fiery pit, with her possessions stripped bare, she had time to reflect on her past choices and realize her mistakes. Legal Lee saw a penitent woman and was compelled to help her. Of course, she could have been totally unrepentant and Legal Lee would still have taken her as a client, but at least a lesson was learned. Step on your
come for the black wedding that would unite Johnny and Jezebel as Hell's new power couple. The tabloids were already calling them Johnny Bell, but Johnny had something different in mind. Hey, Satan! You want to get out of here? I can't believe that worked. Occam's razor. Playtime is over, Mr. Gat. Save them if you can. I love weddings. Find the right words. No. 
And like that, the battle had ended. Satan could no longer suffer the indignity of being beaten by a mortal and disobeyed by his daughter. And so he banished them from perdition. But still, all was not well. That was a direct order from your captain! You're worse than Pierce! Trivia night is sacred! You don't get to quit just because you know fuck all about pop culture. Who knows the name of the Nightblade episode where they introduced Nightbladeette? It was called The Meaning of Reconciliation and it was directed by Kim Stein. I can't believe Asha sleeps with you. I can't believe you don't. Boss, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What is this place? Whoa, 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 who the fuck is that? Her name's Jezebel. She's the devil's daughter. Pierce is gonna have a heart attack. Nah, she likes to sing. Pierce will dig her. I don't think... Can you rock the narrator from Joseph? Yeah. She'll be fine. Guys, where's Johnny? Our hero had not yet returned to the mortal coil, for he was waylaid by none other than God himself. I have a situation. Look, man, I just really want to go home. I owe you. Huh? Zinyak hastened the apocalypse. St. Peter's a good guy, bless his heart, but he was processing souls way too slowly. With the destruction of Earth, Satan had the numbers to storm heaven. All he needed was the President of the United States to lead them. What, you think I couldn't do it? No, I think you wouldn't do it. Aisha's up here. I want to see her. Slow down, buddy. I said that I owe you, and I'll make good on that. But I want you to know your options. And now you, dear reader, shape the tale. If you want to see Johnny reunited with the love of his life, turn to page 31. If you want to see the devil defeated and Johnny crowned the new king of hell, turn to page 13. If you want the saints to find a new home world for what's left of humanity, Turn to page 62. If you want God to recreate the Earth, but in doing so retcon the entire world of Saints Row, turn to page 124. And finally, if you want God to bestow Johnny with the answers to all the questions of the universe, turn to page 248. In Hell's weakened state, the Heavenly Host made short work of Satan and those who were loyal to him. Soon, Johnny was the new ruler of Hell. Kind of pretty, isn't it? Yeah, it kind of is. Do you miss your friends? Nah, I know they'll be down here in no time.